Hey everyone, this is Mike with Omega Survival, and I'm going to be showing you the Coast HP-14 Pure Beam Focusing Light. This light has 629 lumens on high and 52 lumens on low. It's 8.4 inches long and weighs 14.2 ounces, and it takes four AA batteries. Now, this isn't what I would call an EDC light at all. This is a rather large light. Um, I would compare it probably to a medium sized mag light in almost all aspects and its shape, in the way it feels. Uh, the quality is very good. Coast makes a really awesome light. It's got a rear push button, and I'll show you how well this performs. I'm gonna take you guys outside and show you some real use in pitch black on the trail. And Coast uses the parabolic lens and it's a one hand operation to focus. There's a flood down to a beam and it actually is an extremely bright light. It says 629 lumens, but I think at the point where it's a beam, it's a little brighter because of the way it focuses. Is that nice lanyard hole? There's nothing cheap about this light. I think you could pick them up for like 50 bucks. At Coast, they sell them on Amazon, eBay, you can get them at Walmart. It's a really good light. It also, when you push it down and twist it until you hear it click, it locks in place and you can't move it. So it would be locked in place that way on the flood or if you put it on a beam and twist it. It locks in place. It's a little tricky sometimes. There it is. Now it's locked in place. You can't move it. But uh, stay tuned. And I'm going to bring you guys outside. And show you how this performs on the trail. Well everybody, here it is. The Coast HP-14. It's got a focusing beam. It's got a very good grippy handle, very streamlined light. There's the push button in the back and a nice size lanyard hole. So stay tuned. And I'm going to show you a little bit of the performance of this light. And I do believe the HP stands for high performance. So stay tuned. All right, here's the beam. I'm going to focus it out so it's a flood. And it does a really good job. Yeah, pretty much brightening up and eliminating an entire area. I'm going to go back to a beam. Very intense beam. There's low. There's low. High. The medium. All at about 100, 100 or so feet, maybe 125 feet. There's low again. Medium. No, I'm sorry, that's medium. There's high. Let me take you for a quick shot down by the water. Here we are down by the water. And it is a one hand operation for the beam.
very bright. Incredibly powerful beam on this. Here's the trestle. Here's my little Fetwood fire still going about a half hour later. Just three nice chunks of Fetwood. So there it is. There's some actual field use of the Coast HP 14. I hope you enjoyed my video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, thanks for watching.